Hello, this is Bob Hollis with the Mobius Network and today I'm going to show you how to upload and download files in cPanel using File Manager and how to uh, compress and back up folders of files using File Manager in cPanel. Uh, this can come in very handy for Joomla 1.5 sites or Drupal 6 sites where you don't have uh, internal systems that are easy and efficient for uploading files. Uh, often you can use an extension, uh, well there are several available for both uh, Joomla Explorer comes to mind as one and use those as uh, file managers within your Joomla system or the equivalent Drupal option. Uh, but if you'd like to use cPanel which is uh, included with all hosted Mobius network sites you can do it this way. So once you've logged into cPanel by going to your site name URL front slash cPanel which will first ask you to log in and then take you to this page on your site. You can go down to file manager and once you're in file manager most of your website content, uh, everything that shows to the public certainly is included in the public HTML folder so if you were to want to upload or download anything to from or to or from that folder you can do so using these options here uh, so if for example this file of images was something that I wanted to download I can click the file compress it and then use the download option to download the compressed file and decompress it on my desktop uh, one of my favorites is uh, 7-Zip for that purpose, which is a free and open source software package available for download, uh, most likely on SourceForge. Uh, so that's how you would compress and download a folder. So if, for example, you were going to back up a Drupal site, and I don't have uh, Drupal ins uh, uh, an instance of Drupal here to show you, unfortunately, but if uh, you had your site folder and you wanted to just keep a backup of that uh, while you're in the middle of an upgrade or an update then that's one way that you can do it. Grab it here, compress it, download it to your desktop as a backup while you upgrade Drupal and then you've got a backup that you can restore if you have any problems. Which uh, coincidentally on a side note you should back up your entire site before you do an upgrade and that's covered in a different video on this channel using cPanel to back up and restore your website. Uh, but some people like to do it a quick and easy way without doing the full backup restore. They just want to make sure that they've got backup copies of their most important folders, which in the case of Drupal may be your, your sites, uh, which are a bit distinguished from the standard programs, uh, standard file folders that are uploaded as part of the Drupal upgrade. So that is how you could, uh, that's how you back up a particular folder. Highlight the folder in cPanel, File Manager, compress it, download it. And then once it's downloaded, if you ever needed to bring it back, you can select it uh, using the upload feature, browse to it, and upload it back to the same folder, and then extract. It's a pretty simple process, uh, but if you have any questions, feel free to contact me anytime. Bob at the Mobius Network.com. Hope you find this helpful.